Welcome viewers, in this video we will see the reduction of switching equation by Boolean algebra using the De Morgan's theorem. Subscribe the channel for more videos and notification. Soft copy of this material available in the drive, link is given in the description box. Now we will go to the topic, reduction of the switching equation by Boolean algebra. In this video we are using the De Morgan's theorem. The given expression is A plus B C bar the whole bar. We need to reduce this expression. So, it is written here A plus B C bar the whole bar. So, by using this De Morgan theorem A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar dot B bar. By using that we can write this. This is the A. We will take this is A and this is B. So, that A bar dot B C the whole bar. Right. So, A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar dot B bar. Again, this B C bar the whole bar can be written as A B whole bar equal to A bar plus B bar. So, we can write this based on that this B C whole bar can be written as B bar plus C double bar. C double bar is nothing but C only. Right. So, based on this De Morgan's theorem B C double bar is written as B bar plus C double bar that is C. Now, we will multiply inside. So, that A bar plus A bar into B bar, A bar into C, right. So, we got that A bar B bar plus A bar into C, right. So, this given expression is simplified like this. So, we use both the De Morgan's theorem, A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar dot B bar, A B the whole bar equal to A bar plus B bar. Now, we will go to the next problem. The second problem is A plus B the whole bar plus A bar plus B the whole bar. We need to simplify this expression. So, it is written here A plus B the whole bar plus A bar plus B the whole bar. So, we can use this theorem, De Morgan's theorem A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar dot B bar. So, based on that this can be written as A bar dot B bar. So, this one is written as a double bar already one bar is there. So, A double bar dot B bar right. So, so in this this A double bar become A that will get the original value. So, that A bar dot B bar plus A into B bar right. So, we applied this theorem A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar plus A bar into B bar. Now, in this the A B bar is available commonly we can take B bar outside. So, that what we have A bar plus A, A bar plus A. A bar plus A is nothing but 1, right. A, the number with the complement of number is added will get 1 only. For example, A equal to 1 means A bar will be 0. So, 1 plus 0 is 1. Suppose A is 0 means A bar will be 1. So, 0 plus 1, 1 again 1 only. So, that A bar plus A equal to A plus A bar equal to 1. So, B bar into 1. So, finally, we have B bar. So, this given expression is now simplified into B bar. Now, now we will go to the third problem. In this third problem, it is given A B bar plus A B C the whole bar plus A into B plus A B bar to the whole bar. Again, one more entire bar is available, right. So, it is written again. A B bar plus A B C the whole bar plus A into B plus A B bar the whole bar right. So, by using the De Morgan's theorem A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar into B bar. So, we will write like this. So, this is A, this is B. So, A plus B the whole bar equal to A bar into B bar right. Now, first it is written. Now, we will go for the further simplification. See here the two bars are available, double bar available. So, that is removed, right, double complement available. Now, we will take this A into B plus A the whole bar, right. So, this B plus A B is written as B plus A based on this theorem, based on the uh, theorem A plus A bar B equal to A plus B, right. What is that? A is written as it is. A's complement is available that no need written. Another variable B, right. So, the single term written as it is in double term the complement is not written 
remaining value is written so a plus a bar b is equal to a plus b so based on that b plus a b bar is nothing but b plus a the single term written as it is the complement is b bar the other term is a so the a is written b plus a right so we simplified that b plus a b bar equal to b plus a based on this theorem now we'll go for the further simplification so this term is written as it is a b bar plus a b c here again we can write a this is b a into b the whole bar equal to a bar plus b bar okay we can use the uh, another de morgan theorem a into b the whole bar equal to a bar plus b bar right the b is nothing but b plus a so what we got a bar plus b plus a the whole bar right again we can apply this de morgan theorem here b plus a the whole bar equal to b bar dot a bar right a plus b the whole bar equal to a bar dot b bar like that we can use so now what we have a b bar plus a b c into a bar plus b bar a bar right now we'll take this a outside in this two term take outside so b bar plus b c here take a bar outside right so 1 plus b bar right so b bar plus b c can be written as b bar plus c based on this theorem also right based on this a plus a bar equal to a plus b right i already told single term right as it is in double term the complement is no need to written other term you need to write right b bar single term is written as it is b bar complement is b no need to write other term c you would write see this a is written as it is the complement of a is a bar a bar is not written the complement with that another variable b is available that is written right similarly here 1 plus b bar 1 plus b bar is always 1 any variable added with 1 will give 1 only right based on that it is 1 plus b bar is 1 right now what we have a into a bar a into a bar is always 0 number with complement of number will give 0 so finally we got the value we equal to 0 right so in this expression the first given expression a plus b the whole bar is written as a bar into b bar so that two double two complement two times available that is removed then this is simplified based on this b plus a after simplification again we apply the de morgan theorem a into b the whole bar equal to a bar plus b bar Again, here we applied the de Morgan's theorem. A, B plus A, the whole bar equal to B bar into A bar. Then A bar is taken outside. Here A is taken outside. This 1 plus B bar means always it is 1. B bar plus B is written as B plus C. B bar plus C. A into A bar is always 0. Right? So finally, we got 0. So in this video, we discussed the reduction of switching equation using the boolean algebra by using de morgan's theorem we solve the three problems subscribe the channel for more videos and notification soft copy of this material available in the drive link is given in the description box thank you for listening